It's your boy Wells coming to you with another Apex Legends video today. Now today we'll be reacting to the Chinatown market event skins that's supposed to be coming uh, very, very soon. Now what else comes with this? I have no idea. This is honestly my first time checking all of this information out and I wanted to give you guys my honest reaction. So I hope you guys do enjoy this video. Don't forget to drop a like and comment. I told you guys I would not be asking for subscriptions. Um, before, before people subscribe anymore, do you want to subscribe? It's down there. You know what to do. But we do have memberships on the channel and I'm thinking of this idea for memberships. And if you guys are interested, let me know down in the comment section below before we get into this video. Uh, memberships for inspiring YouTubers like yourself. Uh, I know I have 7K. I'm not that big of a um, content creator just yet, but I've been doing it since 2014. Like, I've been doing it for a long time. And um, my only biggest problem was consistency. But as far as the content creation and the settings and all the behind the scenes stuff, I'm very pretty much decent with it. So I've thought of having a membership program where I teach you guys all the tips and tricks that I've learned over the years for in inspiring people that want to create gaming content. If that sounds interesting to you, let me know down in the comment section below. And now without further ado, let's get into this video. All right, so before we get into this video, I want to give a big shout out to my boy Shrug Tool for uh, creating this video. So I will leave the link to the original video as I do with all my reaction videos down in the comment section below. So make sure you guys go watch his video as well. Uh, because as a YouTuber out here trying to grind, everybody need as uh, many views and support as they can. So let's get in. And respawn. They've produced four skins which will be available for purchase for a limited time from the 30th of March onwards. This will probably run for two weeks, but don't quote me on that. It could just be a single week. It depends on how they want to handle the regular store. But enough waffle. The four skins are as follows. There's Mirage's Nightcrawler skin. Mmm. Mmm. I like the samurai swords in the back though. This is a nice skin. I like it because it's kind of like they took his default skin and just put their own spin on it pretty much. Because it's pretty much the same colors of his default skin and just added a little badass. I, I like it. I rock with it. What do you guys think? I say out of 1 out of 10, I get his skin. This is a 10. This is a 10. This is a 10. Ringside Wraith. Mm. Sundown. Mmm. Let's go back to the Rayphone real quick. Mm. Mm. Eh. It, it, it's nice. It, it, it's, it's cool. But if I'm going to keep it a buck 50, well, I don't know even if they got a Pathfinder one yet. Because like I said, this is my first time watching this at all. But if they had a Pathfinder one, maybe the boxing one should have went towards Pathfinder. Honestly, I'm going to be real. I, eh, I give this a 3 out of 10. At Wraith. Sundown Desperado. Mm. And. Mm. I'm not feeling it. <laughs> like, I don't want to be that dude that just bash all the skins. Like, they look cool, but I'm not. I'm not feeling it. I give it a 1 out of 10. This is probably not that awesome. Just being a buck. Just, just keeping it a buck with you guys. You know, I got to keep it real. Mike Check Lifeline. Okay. This is swaggy. This swaggy. Swaggy. This is fire. I get this easily. Ten out of ten. Like it just, it's dope. I don't see many people gonna rock this often, but this is a really, really nice skin. I dig the the, the hippie hat. I dig the glasses. Just the whole vibe of this skin is. Ugh, whoever did this, did some justice. Now these skins will be available for purchase in the following bundles. There's the Lifeline Trip Bundle mm -hmm. with Temperature Rising Banner, Doc Charm, okay. and My Check Lifeline. There's the Fire Bloodhound Bundle with ah, the Lowrider Flatline this is, uh, and Sundown Desperado. Uh, Mirage Flex Bundle, which comes with the Swordplay Banner, the Mirage Punching Bag Charm, and Mirage's Nightcrawler Skin. Finally, there's the Wraith Hype Bundle, which comes with the Bobblehead Wraith Charm and the Ringside Wraith Skin. Come on, man. That, that, that's the worst bundle out of all of them. Rafe honestly shouldn't even got a skin out of this. I don't even know why I gave it to her. Uh, clearly, because she's the popular, the most popular legend. Probably second to Horizon now. But besides the point, I don't think Rafe should have got a skin. Uh, But eh, I think she has. I think, I'll be honest. I get this, this a three. But 
I take that back. I think Bloodhound skin is better than this one. So eh, I don't see anything special about this skin. That I don't, I'm not. I'm not oh, in, in awe. Like you know. Now if you not do been a Wraith hater, I love Wraith. Love Wraith by the way. Love every legend. Except Fuse. But any items in the bundle already or craft them, you should get the applicable discount as bundles usually will reduce their price if you own the items in them. So you could essentially just single purchase the skins if you craft all the items in the bundle. But if you just want all four skins, the whole collection, there's an opportunity to get all of that in the Mega Chinatown bundle, which will contain only the four skins. So an option for you if you don't want to just target one skin, you want to get the whole collection. At least that's awesome. Now, you must remember that there is going to be no alt TM or price track for this. This is just a store takeover. And since it is not a collection event, crafting won't be available for these skins. But like I said, if you craft the... Okay, that's that's pretty much it. Uh, that's pretty much it. That's the video. Um, So far, I I like the skins. I just don't think Rift deserves one. I don't think the skin was that fire. Actually, I moved the Bloodhound skin up to a four. And I, give, I keep the Rift at a three to a one. Uh, but... That's just my opinion. Let me know down in the comment section below what you guys think. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And uh, I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.